Hey guys, so I'm back. Before I go to sleep, I have to tell y'all this. Every day, it's been some good news back to back to back. Like God has been doing some amazing things for me. And I know for a fact that it's only God because it's not me doing it. Because there's no possible way. It's no possible way that I'm doing it. It's all him that's doing it for me, you guys. And if y'all look at my story, y'all will see some of the things that he's been doing. I was blessed to actually be a key speaker today. And I was able to meet Maxine Waters. Like, she's an inspiration to me. Like, I'm so inspired by her and, like, all the work that she has done in the community. And so to meet her and speak and be on the same stage as her today, while she got honored, was a blessing. All right, you guys. So, I'm just going to tell y'all this. I was going to actually wait to tomorrow because this is something that I've been living by. And it literally has helped my life. Like, it literally has helped my life. Instead of, you know, dealing with our issues like the normal way that we do, I want you to start treating it like this and say this. It's always a solution to the problem. Say it with me. There's always a solution to the problem. I promise you. So if y'all start using that, you will literally look at the world in a different way this has really truly helped me and i don't know who i'm talking to but if, if this you know resonates with you then this is for you understand this also this too um if you're thinking about getting that car and you're like oh my gosh i can't get a new car because i don't have the money give it to god and go get your car Things will come. If you're like, oh my gosh, like, should I, should I invest? I don't know. I don't want to lose my money. Invest that money because God's going to help you. Have faith and pray to him and have good intentions. If you're like, um, I don't, I don't know. Should I, should I go treat myself to a trip? Treat yourself because the money's going to come back literally probably like the next day or within a week. You know, I've been like listening and learning from different pastors and this is all true. And I'm going to relay the message that I've gotten from them. It's not in details, but you get it. But yeah, don't, um, don't limit yourself, man. Like that's, that's, that's basically what I'm saying. And I'm going to be honest. I've jumped myself into some situations in the past and even in the present. And I'm like, oh my gosh, like. How am I about to... I'm like, wait a minute. Bro. God wouldn't bring me this far to tear me down. It just doesn't work that way. You just have to have faith and give it all to him. Because if you do it through him, then it's a keeper. And he's going to make sure that it's multiplied. And when you do... or Whenever you do get up, um, meaning like, oh, I'm up on money, I'm up on this, and I'm up on energy. Like, share it. Share it with the people around you. You know what I mean? Um, I know a lot of people don't go to church, so they like they don't tithe or they're like, oh, I don't want to go to church because they're going to ask me for money. But yeah, you don't necessarily have to tie to the church. You can sow seeds into other people. So basically what that means is, you know, if you're up and you know that you got a good deal or or a big deal or just like something came in, right, and somebody's actually struggling, and you see this, you can help them and sow a seed, you know, because God will love, like what he will love that. And he likes that for us to help each other and not to tear down each other, especially if somebody is in need. But um, it took me a little second to realize that and, and just have pure intentions, pure intentions when you do do that, because we're living in a time right now where it's, everything's high. You know, and sometimes we kind of fall short. So if you see somebody struggling, um, just help them out. You know what I mean? Or teach them a way how to even how to make some money, you know?
Good morning, Riley. I'm at, I'm about to go to the gym. Say good morning to everyone. Riley. Riley. All right. This is why I can't get up, y'all. I just love him so much. Riley. Riley. Uh, you don't want to get up? Rage on that beat, gon' crave.